Although much of the world has focused their attention and awe upon the unquestionably advanced ancient feet of the ancient pyramids of Giza, Mexico, along with most of Southern America, also possesses many equally astonishing feats of a now lost ancient civilization. Gigantic cities perfectly created to house those who built them, along with what is probably the most significant of ruins, now known as the modern Mexico City, it was once the origins of the settlement itself. Although the age is unknown, this magnificent and mysterious place was once known as Tenochtitlan, quoted as the Venus of the Aztecs and ancient capital of the Aztec Empire. It initially started as an isolated settlement, created on natural islands within the Lake Texcoco. What makes it special, however, is that it eventually expanded out, with the now lost builders of the site constructing an entire city's foundations complete with giant pyramidal structures upon artificially constructed floating islands. It contained the Palace of Montezuma II, said to have once consisted of over 300 rooms as well as hundreds of other temples of considerable proportions. It was eventually destroyed by the Spanish conquistadors under Hernán Cortés in 1521. At the time, this amazing floating city had an estimated population of 400,000 people. It eventually spread over onto neighboring lakes and also the land surrounding them, covering a span of five square miles. It was connected to the mainland by several causeway dikes that terminated in smaller lakeside urban communities. Along with the many pyramid temples, the original construction is still highly debated, clearly due to its inexplicable architectural design and the clear advanced capabilities of its creator, one which does not coincide with the modern paradigms of history. The great market in the barrio of Tlatelolco was reported by the Spaniards to have had at least 60,000 buyers and sellers on the main market day. How did a claimed primitive culture create such an astonishing artificial island city, in addition to the ancient pyramids which surrounded it? It was undoubtedly a place which we would have found highly compelling.